It seemed like everybody's ready. Yeah. Ready they were. Millions of Americans back on the move tonight, heading back from their holiday destinations. The country is wrapping up its first somewhat normal holiday since the start of the pandemic. TSA and AAA report record travel numbers, beating even pre pandemic numbers with Americans ready to enjoy newly returned freedoms. Hello, everyone. I'm Vic Carter. And I'm Denise Coco. People are now heading home from the unofficial kickoff to summer. More than 37 million people hit the roads or took to the skies for Memorial Day weekend. The weekend broke records we haven't seen since the beginning of the pandemic. WJC is live. Amy Kawada with a closer look at the numbers and how travelers are feeling. Amy. Denise, Vic, well, the traffic here at BWI has definitely died down from earlier today. Many people we spoke with tell us they are returning back home from their first major trip in over a year. The TSA says there were nearly 2 million air travelers on Friday. That's the highest number recorded since the start of the pandemic. Minnesota. San Juan, Puerto Rico. A welcoming sight for the travel industry as Marylanders kick off the unofficial start of summer. We were just glad to get away for a couple days. AAA predicts a 60% spike in travel from this time last year, both in the skies and on the roads. Here in Maryland, more than 700,000 people are estimated to return home after heading out of town for the holiday, despite the price at the pump. According to Gas Buddy, the national average for gas is a little over $3 a gallon, the highest since. 2014. I think people are just eager to get out and travel. Air travel has slowly climbed in recent months. Airlines say bookings have surged due to pent up demand, and travelers flying this summer can expect semi normal skies. You can definitely feel the, the shift. Yeah, it's starting to, things are starting to open back up, and it's, it's good to have, have the world return a little bit. At BWI, data shows a steady increase in passenger traffic over recent weeks, with this holiday marking another busy weekend in the books. There was a lot yeah. of people, but we didn't feel overwhelmed at all. Um, we felt safe. The travel rush comes as COVID cases decline to the lowest number of new cases in more than a year, and over half of Americans now partially vaccinated. I've been fully vaccinated, and I've also had COVID. And she's been fully vaccinated, so we didn't think there'd be any problem. And although this holiday weekend is wrapping up, the start of the busy summer travel season is right around the corner. Keep in mind, Maryland is still requiring face masks on all public transportation. And the TSA is also still requiring masks at airports and on airplanes. Live at BWI tonight, I'm Amy Kuwata for WJZ.